Hey guys, Real Imaginary here. Today I'm doing the Power of Makeup Challenge. I kind of missed the boat on this one, but I wanted to do it. Um, I know a couple people have asked how I do my makeup, so here you go. I use a CoverGirl palette. I don't have any fancy makeup. I just use all this crap that I can get at Walmart. And I start out, I do a smoky eye effect. Start out with the darkest color. And I always make the outline. Um, I start with the corner. I guess and well you'll see you'll see what I do I just shape my eyeshadow sometimes I'd like to have more of a dramatic point or like a more gradual point and then I connect it and then I go back in with that darker eyeshadow and I fill in the very outer corner and that gives me that hard definition on the outside. Sometimes it's a little tricky to see what the hell I'm doing because I'm right-handed and doing my right eye is a little bit challenging at times, but I do it because I like how it looks. The next thing I do is I take one of my flat end brushes and I use the second color in. It's a medium brown color and I just do right in the center of my eyelid and it covers, I forgot which side I had the uh, product on. I just do the very center of my eyelid and blend it into the darker part. Then I go for the uh, sec the second color, I guess it is, in the palette. It's the shimmery one. And do the inner corner and blend it in and blend it up into the outline. And then, wow, I'm really going fast with this. And then I use the first color on the palette, that really light gold yellowy color, and just cover the very upper top just kind of make it pop and to fix if I mess up or anything. My eyeliner is just a Rimmel uh, regular, it's not a pencil, it's like a like a liquid liner but it's you just twist it up. You don't have to sharpen it or anything. I start on the outer edge and I work my way in. Uh, usually I try to do a thin line but it never works out because I always mess up somehow so it just gets thicker and thicker as it goes and I try to smooth it out the best I can and then I just do the bottom lid like normal. Wow that coloring is terrible. Let's see. Ah, I noticed. Eh, I'll, I'll deal with the bad coloring for a second while I do my lower lid. Then what I do is I pull back my face and I do- oh, huh, getting a text message. Sorry. And then I just make my wing. I will do from the top and bring it back and go along my eyeshadow line. And then I bring the bottom one up to meet it, and if I need to fix it or make it better, I do. I use the Scandal Eyes uh, Mascara. I love how thick and big it makes my eyelashes look. It's got a really cool wavy looking uh, brush. So I put it on the top of my lashes first, get them, I brush it through really well, I twirl it, make sure it looks really good, and then I come up underneath and just give them that lift and get them all nice and coated and it makes them nice and dark. And then I do my bottom lashes. And I hate the fact that you have to like open your mouth whenever you do the bottom lashes. Like why is that? The foundation I use is <laughs> Neutrogena. I, I cannot pronounce it. <laughs> I use what's in the lid. I shake it up and then use what's in the lid. And I just use a dotting method and just do usually about three dots on my cheek to cover up the redness and since this is the power of makeup I'm only doing half of my face so in case you were wondering and it works best to do your foundation as like a triangle as opposed to just like a crescent half circle moon underneath your eye because you elongate it down your face and make it blend in better I don't use any of those beauty blenders or anything I'm not really into makeup I just do my own makeup um, I don't necessarily feel, oh, my hair fell on my face, that I need makeup. I just like the way I look the best with makeup. I know this is the first time you guys have seen me without makeup, so I hope it's not too scary. <laughs> this is my everyday wear makeup. I do this every day before I leave the house. This is my normal makeup. It's what you see me with pretty much every video I have on here. <laughs> and I just use the L'Oreal N3 True Match Powder, and I'm almost out. That was what that face was for. I need to get a new one, but you know. And I just use the applicator that came with it. I really need to get a new one because that one is looking pretty ragged. But, and I just 
cover all of the foundation that I did. And I don't use any special lip gloss, I just use the EOS, EOS, whatever the hell it's called. Those big ball looking things. I use them. Just did half my lips, which is a really terrible, awful feeling. And well, there you have it. There is half of my face done up, half none done. You know, there's this big whole point behind this power of makeup and I totally forget it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Like and favorite and subscribe and become one of my imaginary friends. Bye!